Okay guys, here we are. In a lovely place called Bebbington. And this morning, train team, customers complaining of a block toilet in this little extension here. I've been in, just been in and put the <coughs> auger in, but I couldn't clear it. So fortunately and conveniently, we have a manhole here. So we'll get this up, have a quick look inside and uh, plot our moves from there. Okay guys, it's full. A little look in there. Okay, so the problem is uh, not this way or that way, it's uh, leading up the drive up here. So I think uh, we'll have a little prod around first with the plunger see what's happening That went in nice and easy. Do you know what? I think I'm going to get some rods out. See if I can rod this one. Okay guys, I'm just using the normal Bailey screw together rods. Uh, not the lock fast. But uh, I think it'll be okay. the rain keeps off it's been lashing it down this morning uh, really heavy resistance there right one of the reasons it's good to use the rod sometimes is if you do get a blockage that is quite um, stubborn it doesn't take long for the manhole to fill up with sewage and then you you kind of end up with a, a big clean up if it starts coming out of the out of this the manhole itself. So if I can clear this I've got a little bit of a bubble there, so potentially we're very close to this. A lot of peas and uh sweet corn coming up so that's always a good sign the peas are a bonus obviously right more rods i've lost count how many rods are in probably probably about six
Okay. Let's get these out. Right, so Right guys, we are basically outside or very close to the uh, boundary, so if you look at the length of the rods that have gone in, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, so there's ten metres of rods on there and um, that went right up to the boundary if not just beyond so the dilemma is do I have another go with the rods and see if we can uh, crack this problem yeah do you know what I'm going to take the uh, plunger off I take a, take a plunger off and drop it into the uh, manhole. That's it. Well done, Tony. We'll get that back out in a minute. Like it's in something quite solid there. Eh? Turn to the right as you should do when you're using screw together rods, just to keep everything nice and tight. Be beaten here, guys. We may have to get the jester in. Chester on it. It doesn't look like it's going down. 
just changing tactics, we're not defeated, we're just changing tactics. Before you get too excited guys. To be honest, I'm, you know, I, I am a bit concerned that being right up there next to the border, um, it could really be a utilities, you know, a utilities company issue. But, I don't know if I don't get the jetter out. Okay guys, uh, nozzle of choice today, as usual really, worm nozzle, 15 metre hose, D8 hose. Hopefully we're in there, keep your head down, in case you've got low back. Not in. Not in there. Position is if this manhole films right up to the top and I can't clear it, and I believe that the problem is on the other side of the boundary, I'm gonna stop because I don't want to leave sewage all down the uh, driveway. Uh, it's, it's it's kind of um, it's on an incline coming backwards there, so it'll all. all uh, gather underneath and onto the customer's patio so and there's nowhere to put it if the drain's blocked so I'm, I'm gonna if it does fill up I'm gonna stop before it comes out some proper resistance there though guys I know what you're thinking. Why didn't you get the jetter out to begin with, Tony? Would have saved you a lot of messing about. But I'm a glutton for punishment. And just to alleviate any uh, thoughts of, oh, it's all about how much time I'm on the job. It's a fixed price uh, unblock. So I could be here for two hours, half an hour, it don't matter. The customer doesn't pay any more.
long as I'm enjoying myself, that's the main thing. meters of, uh, of pipe in there so I'm going to draw it back 14 meters of hose down the pipe
Right, terrain team. Like I said, uh, I think the blockage is past the boundary. I kind of proved that. I put, I put 14 meters of uh, hose in there, and as you can see by the rods, they're meter long rods, and uh, the driveway is approximately 10 meters. So I've gone right outside the boundary. So we've got, got probably half a tank left. Uh, I've used, I've put in probably about 200 litres. Uh, and like I said, starting to fill up I'm not going to go any further with it uh, it's not really my job to be working out here anyway so but in for a penny in for a pound did my best on that uh, listen if you enjoyed the videos click the like button click the notification button if you've subscribed thank you very much for continuing to uh, support the channel if you haven't go on hit that subscribe button uh, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of um, nearing the uh, 6,000 subscribers, which is brilliant. Never thought uh, people would be interested in uh, in this kind of thing, but obviously you are. But the most important thing, even though it's a miserable day, you make sure you have a great day.